guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to do the colored um, shape effect on Videostar. So you're just going to want to go um, onto Videostar and to select song and then click make video. This is just really normal, what you would usually do. Um, yeah, okay. Alright. So once you've done so, you're going to want to go to the little timer button and select the time. And then go to new effects and I'm just going to make it um, none, so just do it without any effects, so it doesn't matter at all. So yeah, just do whatever. That was probably really awkward, that's okay. Then go to the little scissors tab, go to new, and go to re-effect clip. Then you can choose to edit one, or you can create a new effect, it's up to you really. You have to scroll down in the color tab and select any color, I'm sorry that's my sister. Select any color of your choice, um, I'll just do something like monochrome. It can be moving, or it can be the single one, it doesn't matter. So just re-effect it. So once you've re-effected the clip, then you're going to want to go to select and set your normal clip. And then re-effect it again. This time, use like a different color. I usually prefer something that's not moving, for example, hue shift. I'll just, my camera looks really weird, but um, I'll just do that one. It's up to you which one you want moving and which one you don't. So now you should have like three clips. One is the one color that's moving and then one is the one that's not. So yeah. Then you're going to want to go to new and go to multi-layer clip. For the back, select the color that is like still, the one that's not moving. And then for the front, you select your colored one. Now here is where you, uh, you guys, the main part. So you're just going to have to click on shape. And then you can use this little arrow button to scroll through all the different shapes. Um, I really like all of these. They work really well. But honestly, this is my favorite. So, yeah. I really like the circle. So, just select yours. You can resize it with two fingers and you can also move it around. I'll just do it to like a smaller size like that. Yeah. And then just click next. <laughs> And now you can like add brightness or whatever to your photos, if to your video, I'm sorry. But yeah, then just click create. I just brightened it up so that it looks pretty. So yeah, that's basically how you get the colored effect. Um, you can also choose any other shape of your choice. So yeah, hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys. If it was, don't forget to leave like a comment or a subscribe. And comment more tutorials because I have no idea what to do for these videos. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Bye!